You should watch anime openings. And I know what you're thinking. Why? Why would I need to? What do I really gain from watching something that doesn't push the plot along? I'll tell you what. Memories. There's nothing like watching an anime opening from an anime that you watched a long time ago. It hits you right in your heart. You feel it. You know exactly where you were and what you were doing when you were watching it. Every so often, I'll see an anime opening from long ago and it'll give me my feelings. Because there's just something about seeing the old anime you used to watch. And you used to think how much time has passed since then. How you've grown and how you probably wouldn't even watch something like this anymore. But back then, it was all you knew. It was so fresh and new to watch anime. Like for me, watching Kotekyo Hitman Reborn's openings, all of them are just classics to me. They're all nostalgic. But the first opening, it gonna hit me like a truck each time. It was one of the first anime that I remember just watching full through. Nobody told me to watch it. I just watched it. And I might be only talking about openings and that may be what's in the title. But this applies for endings also. I watch every ending also one of the best endings to me and most nostalgic is bleach's first ending it took me about being a child just on the bed watching bleach off my phone and get to the end of the episode come on like watching these things will just take you back it doesn't even have to be super old things like for example i remember watching demon slayer whenever that came out it came out recently and i was watching it with my brother and i have memories of that now i'd come home from work at like 11 and then we'd watch it and though it wasn't long ago i'm still very nostalgic when i hear demon slayer's first opening and i get it you still may not be convinced but another part of openings and the reason i watch them is because of that excitement factor like if the opening is really bopping like that and you vibing with it you most likely gonna get through that episode like you know those anime compilations like those are like best openings and you'll be like oh okay what's that one that one bopping that's how i was for steins gate now don't get me wrong steins gate is a classic anime but for the longest time up until like two years ago i hadn't seen it i knew of it and i knew it's opening and i really liked the opening before i even started it so when i finally started it i was jamming to the opening like the plot didn't even really matter i was going to get through those episodes no matter what a good opening can elevate a bad anime for me in a great opening and a good opening for a good anime might put that in a classic tier for you i'm not gonna lie it, it just boosts my enjoyment i don't know why probably one of the biggest cases of an anime's opening being just an absolute banger that excites you for the episode is dragon soul in 2010 when dragon ball z kai started on nicktoons that was the first time i had seen dragon ball z in my life like i'd watched the story i'm sure i saw the characters but that's the first time i saw the story and they were jamming you know the exact one i'm talking about the one with vic the definitive one they're jamming like somebody must have put crack into that because that is a top 10 anime opening ever it can be up there with any of them and and i know all the other dragon ball z openings but that has to be consistent best one right even the original japanese version is a banger Th that's how you know it's one of the greatest openings of all time now the only thing that might dissuade you at this point is the fact that you could get spoiled in the opening like one piece had an opening like i think the 22nd one where it was just spoiling like a bunch of stuff apparently in that situation obviously you'd want to avoid it but like 95 percent of anime you don't have to worry about being spoiled about anything and if there is things that are spoilable like you don't even notice them until they've happened like you're only going to understand this certain scene under the right context in which you've already seen it the point is i just think you should watch anime openings there's almost no downside to it and the memories last forever so tell me which ones you have fun memories of.